This is no ordinary sprayer. Sure, the Graco Truco 360 DSP applies paint and stain up to 10 times faster than brushes and rollers. Of course you won't have to thin the paint. It's a Graco, so you know it'll lay down a smooth, even finish every time. The difference is what you don't see. With the Truco 360 DSP, painting just got easier. How much easier? Let's just say it's in the bag. Just fill it with paint or stain, and with one simple squeeze of the bag, you're ready to spray in any direction, even upside down. Then when your project is done, just toss the bag for fast and easy cleanup. And there's no need to thin the paint prior to application, thanks to Graco's longest lasting tungsten carbide pump that easily applies thick materials and leaves a smooth, professional finish with just one coat. The True Coat 360 DSP also features a dual speed setting, giving you optimum spraying control. And for even more control, select either a 4 inch or a 12 inch spray tip to match your project needs. Both included. Whether you plan to paint indoors or outdoors, the True Coat 360 DSP will provide a professional finish, faster and easier than any handheld sprayer on the market. Pick up a True Coat 360 DSP today and discover just how easy painting can be. Graco Truco 360 DSP. It's in the quality. It's in the speed. It's in the ease. Quite simply, it's in the bag. The Wagner Smart Sidekick Direct Feed Powered Roller will help you make quick work of very large or multi-room painting projects. The innovative click attach arm allows the Sidekick to work with any size or shape container from 1 to 5 gallons. The lightweight unit quickly attaches to the container so the pump can move with you throughout the project. The Sidekick's innovative peristaltic pump draws paint directly from the container for a continuous flow of paint to the roller. This delivers a smooth, even finish and means no trips to the paint tray, saving you time on all your painting projects. The roller handle accepts any standard extension pole to help you paint the high and hard to reach places in your home. The versatile Sidekick provides all the productivity and maneuverability required for your large painting project. Hi, Dan with HomeRite. I'm going to show you how to set up and use the Quick Painter. The Quick Painter is a trimming tool that has a pad, a trigger, and a fill handle. To fill it, we're going to remove the pad attachment and put the tip of the Quick Painter into our paint. We're going to depress the trigger, pull back on the fill handle, and wait for a moment while it fills with paint. When it's full, we release the trigger. We're going to wipe off the excess paint from the fill tube.
and now we can put the pad attachment back on. I like the pad attachment opposite of the trigger, and I'll show you why. There's a little air in here, so we'll want to purge that, and what we'll do is we'll want to hold a rag in front of it, and we'll push the trigger, and you'll hear that air come out, and now we're ready to go. You can see the paint is coming out, beginning to come out the holes. Now we're going to use the quick painter to cut in along this window. To do that, I'm going to put the edge, there's a guide on the edge of the pad here, right up against the trim on the window. I'm going to give the trigger a little push to feed a little paint. As I do that, I'm going to move it up and down to work the paint into the pad. Now, as I need a little paint, I'll give the trigger a push. And just working it in, I can cut right up to the edge of the window. After edging is complete, you can remove the pad attachment, depress the trigger and return unused paint back into the can. This will save paint and speed cleanup. Now we're ready to clean up. I have a wash tub with some warm soapy water here. I'm going to put the pad attachment in and let that soak and we'll rinse that out. Next I'm going to show you how to clean up the handle. We're going to hold the trigger and pull water up into the handle. Give it a shake to help loosen the paint. Then press the trigger to discharge the water. We're going to change the water, rinse out the pad, and then we can dry everything off and reassemble it, and we'll be ready for next use.